Greetings to you in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Truth plus love equals life. Boy, are these some uh, strange times we're living in. Crazy beyond description. And I don't know anybody who's really not going through some craziness right now. This is the Meta logo. I think this was a few weeks ago. I don't remember. Maybe a month now. Where Facebook said they changed their logo to Meta. Um, what's curious, I'm just looking at this M right in front of me. The M looks like two people holding hands. I never thought about that. It looks like a husband and wife like holding hands, a little V in the middle. I'm very curious as I look at this. This Meta, uh, now again, it's the Meta mask, which may or may not be lunar currency, but there's something freaky deaky going on with that Foxy logo. Not telling anybody cryptos, but it's just, it's all happening. This whole Metaverse thing is basically like Satan's, Digital assimu simulation of heaven. Really incredible. Now, again, I'm not telling you not to be part of the digital realm because we are. I mean, I'm your, I'm part of it right now. There's just no way around this. This meta, uh, meta, it has to do with twinning. And mitosis and a buddy of mine had said, you know, meta phase. It's the third phase, like basal three, I believe, is what they still call the banking thing. I don't know. I, I think it's still basal three. I don't think it's four or five, but regardless, this is the meta phase. This is the twinning. So they're basically trying to merge their earthly and celestial, good and bad, yin yanger. It's like Jekyll and Hyde agreeing that they're both best friends and they save themselves. It's the New Age deception. Now, capital letter M E, turn the M on its side, is 13, 13th letter E. So if you just you don't have to turn it on its side, I mean, on its side it would be a 33. But if you flip the E, so M and E would be 13. The capital E, if you flip it with their dual vision, that's what this is all about, it's 133. So that's a circle and then a triangle, triangle, hexagram, mark of the beast. The TA is 21. Now, sometimes you drop the zero. I'm telling you, in vortex math, sometimes they boost the zero. So that 201 is really a 2001, like Cooper Space Odyssey. You wonder why they did that? It's because it's a pentagram to a dragon. So if you're new to this channel, what are you talking about? A pentagram. The cardinal points are two at the top, two in the middle, one at the bottom. Draw them in your head. It's a pentagram with the one on the bottom. So it's 221, 2, 22, 22, and alphanumerically, V is the 22nd letter. Why is VV important? That's the dragon. He has two Vs over his head. That's why when Nixon said, I'm not a crook, it's like, no, you're a dragon because you put little two Vs. Okay, I'm serious. So now look at this meta logo here. Look at the X on, on the spot in the middle. They always show you it. It's the weirdest. It's like they're giant masks. You could put two eyes inside the little figure eight and the nose is this little mountain underneath it. And above the X where this meta crosses would be like the third eye, like the pineal gland. There is also an implied triangle over this eight. Like if you just saw it bigger, you could probably fit it nice and snug inside the top of a triangle. This is how they do things. I will say for those who are paying attention, a thousand years from the millennium, when Satan has his last scam, imagine above the third eye, like where the horns would be for a devil is a fourth and fifth eye. What's that all about? I don't know, but it's coming in a thousand years. It'll be some it'll be some other garbage hustle, okay? Like it's just more scammy scam. It'll be the seventh and eighth dimension or whatever it is. So meta in, I believe the meta mask meta mask is the Andromeda mosque. Like the temple in Andromeda in the strain wherever that's at, uh, the Meda M E D A meant provision in like hidden knowing. Well, hello. Can you say uh, crypto space cadet Starbucks? I mean, they're called Starbucks. Cryptocurrencies. Uh, so this is just me telling you, you know, what's going on as I see it. Um, I want good things for humanity. There's nothing I can do. I sure hope these videos take off, but I put these out there for, you know, just out of conscience sake. I appreciate the few people who support me. I really do. It means a lot to me. So this meta thing is over and above it's kind of like the word revelation where you take the lid off except they're creating this whole digital simulation where you'll literally just like i said in the d5 cities where you'll you want to poop all you want you need poop credits literally like you'll need toilet paper credits and you'll need uh whatever it is you'll need a, a, a prostitute credit if you want to see a prostitute if you want like a, on a third bible okay whichever way you want to do it They'll tell you they're giving, I mean, they're literally trying to incentivize everything. So they'll tell you to 
Eat your Wheaties, get your Wheaties point or whatever it is. You want like treat you like a little child. You want ice cream cone? You need to eat the Wheaties over here. You guys like that? I don't like that. I'm the man named Freedom America, the individual, whether anybody agrees or not. Though it sure would be nice if they did. Thanks. The meta, um, think of the terms that have like metamorphosis. They always have to do with this transformational change. Think of when a, a, a tumor metastasizes. <laughs> it's becoming bigger than it was. So it's like the beast is rising like, you know that little shop of whores when they go, suddenly Seymour, and she goes, famous Seymour, and you're like, oh my God. That's the metaverse. So the metaverse is the Ready Player One like fallen angel giant scoreboard. Really, if you want to think about it, it's like how do giants and fallen angels keep score? Well, why do they need to keep score? Because they're Satan's kingdom, and that's what people do: is who's the neatest, who's the strongest, who's the alpha. That's just how it is, and it is freaky deaky. I mean, there's just no way around what's going on. Um. Please repent if you find this. Check out my videos. Truth plus love equals life of the seal of God. I wonder if I should just keep this one short. It is a, a, and not quite a figure eight. Clearly what they're doing is they're trying to birth the W and they're telling you it's time to twin everything. So I'm sure you'll see it like, the, you know, the name Thomas means twin. You'll see a lot of this twinning, the W, the I-N-U for the cryptos. The Inu Inus is the U-N-I, Uniswap. Um, I really wonder sometimes if, uh, if Mark Zuckerberg is like Absalom, I'm serious, David's rebellion son, I'm trying to figure out if there's more to him. It just would not surprise me. I mean, really, if David Rockefeller, he, had a, he has a crypto just called David and Solomon's going to show up claiming to be David, like, was that Solomon's like shapeshifter born in the flesh? Because if Solomon is the rebellious son of David and Absalom is the rebellious son of David and Mark Zuckerberg was, was a Rockefeller, well, then you do it. You know what I mean? Are we dealing with... These are resurrected... <laughs> I mean, these people are not right. These are not normal humans. Zuckerberg looks like Data from Star Trek. And by the way, Data Brent Spiner, he has a... I want you to look this up. He did a song called Old, Ye Old Yellow Eyes, like Frenatia's Old Blue Eyes. Because that's a gold thing. Data has gold eyes. Just like that cute booty of seven of nine from Star Trek. Why do you think they called it seven of nine? Because seven nine is the element for gold. She was the one with the blonde golden booty. And she's beautiful. I mean, Jerry Ryan, she's beautiful. I mean, I like that Judge Zia Dax myself. That Terry Farrell with the blue eyes and the spots. I was like, whoo. But you got to be kidding me with that, with that suit. And everybody knows exactly what you're talking about. I bet she made millions just off wearing that suit. Why do you think it was 7-9? Why do you think he wrote the song called Old Yellow Eyes? Because he's from Texas. I looked it up, folks. This is what I do. Brent Spiner. Hey, they don't call it the Purple Rose of Texas, just in case you wonder. Yeah, it's the yellow one. Because that's the gold. You get it? That's why they put yellow hexagrams on the Talmudics. Now, that was horrible. It was horrible what was done but that doesn't make that hexagram anything other than Mark B. Oh, let's go into this now. Hitler monetized. I will not call them Jews because you have to choose Jesus to become a Jew. I don't hate you if you're Ashkenazi, but they're by and large Ashkenazis. You have Sephardim and there's a, a Lithuanian group that I forget. And I, I'm not disrespecting you. I just don't remember the name of it. So there's a third offshoot of those bloodlines. If you choose Jesus, great. Hitler was monetizing the people. He wasn't so much, in his head, he was putting like a dollar sign on them and saying the people that we're sacrificing are the anchor to which the new system will grow because nobody's more powerful than the super Jew is basically how the Talmudics that sacrificed those people would have thought. And I know that's really difficult for you. And that's just too bad because this is difficult for me too. But we're living in the end times and somebody has to tell you that you're like a man and I pretty much always get punished for it. And that's how it is. And I just have to accept every day I signed up for this. And so I thank you for the people who support me and love me. Both of you guys kick ass. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> so please keep in your prayers. Uh, I'm going to do another video tonight, which is going to blow your mind if you want to listen to it. I mean, please just like or subscribe or send it to somebody, man, because this is awesome stuff. You need to see this. Um, take care. I love you. Please repent. It's really very simple.
Forgive me, Jesus. My everything's wrong. Jesus is one person, three essences, mind, body, spirit, Father, Son, Holy Spirit. Jesus is God the Father in the physical form who died in our place, the only physical part of the one person, three essence, triune Godhead. I love you. Roger that over and out. Repent, people. Now is a really good time to repent. In fact, it's the only time.